Fortnite squad. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to a brand new YouTube video. My name is Michael or Uprising Hero. And if you guys are new to my channel, man, subscribe. I'd love to have you, man. Join the Uprising Army. That I literally just came up with that two seconds ago. But um, today I'm going to be going off of a script that I made. And uh, I'm going to be summarizing the Season 8 story or Season 7 storyline. And talking about the Season 8. Eight leaks that point point to what we have. Uh, currently, there is like 25 days left till the season at the time of this recording, or something like that. Um, so yeah. Other than that, guys, again, it, I'm trying something new. But it, if I feel like I, if I put some some work into it, I hope this video does pay off. So if you guys can share this video with your friends and drop a like, it get out to uh, a larger audience. But other than that, guys, please drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new. Other than that, guys, let's get right into it. So I think we have to start with the season seven storyline. So basically, I think the biggest part of this storyline would have to be the Ice King event. Um, before that, there was pretty much the eggs, and everyone was coming up with theories about that. So the Ice King event, it made the whole map frozen, right? And it gave us the uh, Ice King event, and um, the event wasn't that bad. It was just really annoying because of the monsters and um, the loot. Or uh, the prizes were okay. We got a sled, uh, the Ice King sled. Or, I, I don't know, it, yeah, it was the Ice King sled, and it was a dope camo. It was like a, a black and white camo. It was honestly a really beautiful camo, if I say so myself. Now, the next thing is, they again, like they added the annoying monsters. The, the event ends, right? And everyone starts going down to the basement at Polar Peak, right? And everyone's just summarizing and speculating. Uh, spe speculating and um theorizing what the what the person in the frozen little ice palace or whatever you want to call it someone was frozen down at under po uh, polar peak right and everyone was like oh my gosh who can it be maybe it could be the fire king oh my gosh look who is that like everyone was just thinking like who could this be right and it turns out it was the prisoner as time as days gone by uh things were just happening it was cracking more and um, pretty much it was the fire king from what everyone thought right you know the fire king and the ice king um, you know they fought and the fire king lost and before they landed on the battle royale island he wanted to make sure it was in check but I guess they might have had disagreements and they battled it out and I don't know man that's just pretty much from what everyone thinks um, but that's what I think too it just makes a lot of sense if you think about it um, but again, he breaks out of his cage, um, bringing out the first load, I think week nine loading screen. And you know, it break, it's him breaking out of the little cage at the bottom of uh, Polar Peak. And from there, he's kind of just powerless, right? He's he's locked up. He still has, he still has locks on his body. He doesn't look too good, right? Uh, the next loading screen would have to be him, like by I think it's uh, Paradise Palms. And it's in where Moisty Meyer used to be, and he's right there just chilling by a campfire, okay? And with the campfire, you can just see him, he feels like he's getting back his powers. And uh, a, no a noticeable thing that's happening in the Battle Royale map right now is the ice is currently melting pretty much the whole map. Um, yeah, it's almost all the ice is gone from the map at this current time. But um, it could return maybe in the future, but I highly doubt that. Uh, Vault Plains 2 while we're at it. Now, coming with the prisoner skin, they did add four new stages, and one of them can be found at Polar Peak. I'm not going to show it because, honestly, you guys can go look it up, but basically, one of the stages is at Polar Peak, and it doesn't show too much, but the fourth stage does really show something. Uh, again, I'll show you guys all the stages on screen, but basically, one of the sta all the stages are just him basically getting the more, getting more fiery, I don't know if that's a word, getting more flames on his body, and honestly, I can just say, dude, it looks so amazing. But um, that's pretty much it for him, right? I feel like he's probably going to be... Um, we'll, we'll talk about him more, but something else we need to talk about are the dragon eggs. Now, no one really knows what's going to happen with the dragon eggs. Everyone's speculating that it could, be, it could have something to do with the February event. Or not February, but February with the pigs. Of, I think it's a Chinese thing. I'm not too sure, but you know, to all my Chinese viewers... Um, hi, I don't, I don't know too much about your culture. I don't mean to disrespect it, but I don't know too much about the pig. Or something like that I don't I don't know now we're gonna be jumping into the earthquake event everyone is talking about the earthquake event currently in the files there are like four events that are going to happen we already got the marshmallow event I think that was the fat we need so we still need to get the festivus event and some other ones but the volcano event 
it has to happen, or they've been, oh, no, I'm sorry, the earthquake event is probably going to be happening most likely in the next coming weeks because again, we only have like 25 something days left of the season and within the season, um, they're probably going to make the, the event lead up to season 8. Currently, uh, I feel like this is just my speculation and probably some other people. The Fire King is gonna get his flame, his powers back, and he's probably gonna get the his dragon eggs or just the, his dragons to help him defeat the Ice King. And with all of that, he's probably gonna melt the whole island—not melt it, but melt the ice part of the island. I could just see that happening, and you know, maybe while he's battling, they're both battling, the whole map just turns into complete chaos everything is we get new point of interest half the map is getting destroyed maybe they they'll add some new things or maybe they'll just take out new places something like that that would be pretty cool in my opinion but i if i, I feel like if they do that they're gonna have to add new ways of transportation and mobility but i don't know that's just me now um the earthquake event there's not too much information but there are some it's already con like it's confirmed there it's in the files right now there are some things that are gonna happen i'll put i'll plot it on screen for you guys um, it's not too much, but these are some things that I want to see. Oh, yeah, by the way, a volcano. Volcano might be happening with this event um, due to, you know, I think it was leaked in Season 5 towards the end. If you guys don't know, the Season 5 storyline was kind of weird. We had, like, this cube going around the map, and the map would be going, like, in, or the cube would be going around everywhere every part of the map there was runes and everyone was thinking there was going to be a volcano involved somehow and it was leaked there was a volcano in the files and i'm pretty sure they're going to do this um here are some things that i do want to mention and just you know just bringing out some mentions real quick um i want the map to split apart and these are some things i want to see in season eight uh, i want planes vaulted i want a new weapon i want them to bring back drum gun new mobility changes vault chiller grenades vaulted new point of interest and just new things in general now that's gonna have to wrap up this video guys i hope you guys definitely did enjoy if you guys can drop me a like and subscribe that'd be very much appreciated other than that guys i hope i summarized this whole storyline for you guys. sorry if i stuttered i went off a script for my first time ever usually i just analyze things but uh this is my first video doing it off a of script i hope i did okay uh, i did get the i did think about this idea a while ago but i just never like fully started to think about it like you know make it into a video but again uh, i hope you guys definitely did enjoy if you guys could drop me a like uh comment something let me know what you guys think about the season 8 storyline uh subscribe if you guys are new post put post notifications on but again if you guys can if you guys want minute more videos like this please share this video with your friends it really does help out the channel and uh, if you guys want any new videos let me know in the comment section below and i'll catch you guys in the next one